mountain of pork. It's kind of like thumb sap. They use the same thumb sap broth to prepare it. And mostly it's the pork neck and pork ribs. Part of the spine bone because you see the neck that's connected to some of the spine here. And that's where it is um, very like nice and tender around this area. Also because they cook it for, uh, it's pre-prep already. So then once you're seeing the video over here how they're gonna put it all together. So thumb sap is the broth is the broth that they use from the soup, the thumb sap soup, which is comprised of galanga and ginger and um, uh, like a sour stock lemon with lemongrass. So it's kind of like a, a tangy sour. And once they put it to bring it to a boil, you throw it in a pan, you bring it to a boil. Uh, it just um, they put the seafood sauce on here, the seafood sauce that. You use for dipping, you know, comprised of Thai chili, lime, sugar, palm sugar, uh, uh, parsley, or cilantro. But here, look at here. So I got this sauce left over here, and you just dump it in here like this. Now this is the dish you see. I last time I seen this was when Mark Weens from my migration migrationology. Uh, he ordered it at this Thai place, and I'm thinking my house at, in Thailand. So I'm thinking to myself, where can I find something like this here in Chicago? And I don't know any other place except Paula's Thai Kitchen that does this, uh, this style. I don't, I forgot the name of uh, what is exactly it's called. But you look here, so just look at how much meat. Uh, basically, it's a dish you just pick at the flavor, citrusy. Um, it depends on how spicy you want it, but I don't know if you can control that because they put the seafood sauce in there. Mmm. Oh, that is good. And that is why this is on my best bites of 2020. Now, again, I'm doing, uh, I'm doing, a sh I used to write articles uh, and publish it every year, best bites, but now I figure you guys can see more, feel more of what I'm, you know, experiencing with these dishes. I picked five because I really couldn't find that many this year because of COVID, but look at that. Look at how um, ligaments, tendons. Mm. Just a hint of sweetness too, not too much. See? Mmm. You dip it in here. Just slip the sauce right off. Let me um wet my face, but look at this. <sighs> yes. Let's find a rib part. Let's see what we got. Oh, oh it's falling off already. Look at all these bits. Um I am a messy eater. What is this chapstick doing here? Get out of here. So, yeah. Mmm. Mm. I want to show you guys what happens after I finish this. Take this. Maybe you try to bite the bone marrow off. No, no, no don't. This one is not soft enough where you could bite the bone marrow off. You're gonna break your teeth, don't do it. So, as you can see this mountain of happiness, Mount Pork. Oh, okay. Next up, um, what do we got next up? We got Santo Fruit. Let's get this out of here. Get out of here. So my other best bites from this restaurant Santo fruit, of course, uh, Karat style, Northern Thai Laotian style. You see the sauce is very dark. This is the same um, style as if you know you make papaya salad, you make uh, seafood, the, the, the crab salad. They use the same ingredients, you know, lime, sugar, fish sauce. They got the fermented crab. They put the fermented crab in there, and then. The hog plum, that's the key ingredient, is the hog plum. Let me show you. So this is a skin from the hog plum. It's very sour. Now you know, 
this kind of dish is tam. It's called tam. Okay, that's, you know, like this. It means to pound. You know, a dish is genuine when you can get the hog plum, the seeds from the hog plum. Mmm. Ooh, that is funky. Funky umami goodness. So here we go, the seeds. So you can just suck on the seeds. Hog plums, we call this makok. I think this is called matong. Santo fruit or... Ooh. Cotton fruit. I made it too spicy, but... I'm gonna keep at it. You can eat this with your hands, or you could eat it like this. So this is the fruit itself there. Mmm. It's got a... Almost like a mango texture, but without the sweetness. So it's sour. That's why it goes so good with this sauce. Mmm. And also, you, got, you see some Thai eggplant. They put Thai eggplant in here too. I think there's like five chilies. I'm, my limit is usually like two. Oh my god. But here, see? Look at this sauce. I mean... You could, you could basically just dip... Oh, you know what? That's a good idea. Let's do this. Try to dip this in here. Mm. Now, I'll let you know... If you like the style of food I eat, then order what I'm recommending for my best bites. But if you don't, I probably don't recommend this. Maybe this, but you can learn to love it too. This is a very rare, both of these dishes are very rare. I don't know any other Thai restaurants that serve this. <sighs> Let's take a break. Mm. Mm. Cut. Oh. <laughs> we got a hybrid going on there. Just spill some over there. Let me, uh, uh, uh. All right. This, look how thick and dark that sauce is. That is so good. And the texture of this, this fruit, cotton fruit. Mmm. Sour. I love it. Sour like this. So, when you go to Paula's Kitchen, order this to go. These food, they travel well. They travel really well, these kind of food, so. But this don't let it sit no more than two days, okay? This was from last night, and it's still good. But the longer you let it sit, the spicier it gets. And here we got this fermented crab. Mmm, that I love. Mmm. The meat is so sweet in there. And we gotta cut this fruit up. It just falls right apart from the seed. When he was pounding it, it falls right apart. Mm. Okay, I think I'm gonna. Uh, uh. All right, that's enough. Let me get some water. Oh, too spicy. As for if you don't eat spicy, as for one pepper or two peppers, I could handle maybe two, two and a half, but this is five. Go check out Paula's High Kitchen, order this pork dish. Uh, I don't know exactly what it's called, but just show them the picture or the video and um, just the mount, tell, tell them the mountain of pork with the seafood sauce and pork neck and santo fruit. They know what, they all know what santo fruit is. You're going to go try this right here.